show is going to be about the Confederacy, their military strengths and weaknesses during the Civil War. First thing to note is that the Confederate soldiers are going to wear gray uniforms. That's something that you can use to recognize them when you see battlefield uh, photographs and paintings. All right, so the first military strength of the Confederacy is that the Confederacy had strong military leadership. That's Robert E. Lee right there, and still to this day, he is considered one of the best generals ever trained at West Point Military Academy. This strong military leadership is a strength because the Confederacy had good battle strategies and won most of the battles in the first two years of the Civil War. Another military strength of the Confederacy is that they fought a defensive war. This is a strength because soldiers knew the land and civilians are willing to help Confederate soldiers who are wounded or hungry after a battle. Another military strength of the Confederacy is that it was recognized as an independent country by Great Britain. This is a strength because the Confederacy could still sell its cotton and make money to fight the war. In fact, Great Britain becomes the Confederacy's number one customer for cotton during the Civil War. So the Confederacy has quite a few weaknesses during the Civil War, number one of which is the population. The Confederacy had a very small population. This is a weakness because they don't have enough soldiers to fight. Really early on in the war, the Confederacy has to draft soldiers or force them into the army. And later in the war, the Confederacy has to draft even younger and younger soldiers. There are records to show that soldiers as young as 14 or 15 fought and died on the battlefield. Another military weakness of the Confederacy is that it was mostly an agricultural economy. They didn't have a lot of factories. And this is a weakness because the Confederacy can't produce supplies for war, and they have to buy those supplies from other countries. And the last military weakness of the Confederacy is that they had few railroad lines. This is a weakness because the Confederacy cannot send supplies or soldiers to battle very quickly, and transportation takes much longer in the Confederacy.